Hello, how are you? I thought I would share with you our Family Essentials Products with a Purpose. So if you are looking to clean out your medicine cabinet, let me share with you some of the ways that you can do that. This is not medical advice in any means, but it is just natural and clean remedies that have helped myself as well as others in their um, journey to find clean and natural uh, healthy options for their family. So our number one balm is the Healing Elements Balm and it has lavender and vanilla in it as uh, some of the main ingredients. This is a natural antibacterial antifungal treatment. It is our Swiss Army knife. It has uh, calendula extract in it which is great for healing as well. So if you have cuts, scrapes, burns, um, any type of skin irritation, this will help heal. Um, if you've had stitches or surgery of any kind, this will kind of help heal those uh, incisions and things like that. So this is a really great option. Um, it started, it was founded 20 years ago as a diaper rash cream, but people quickly found out that it can be used um, pretty much anywhere on the body and it has great healing properties. So not just for diaper rash. Um, there are times that we might need to go to a doctor to clear some things up. So definitely do that if you need to. Um, but I will say that anytime we've had kind of the start of anything, um, this has typically been able to clear, you know, things up. Um, the only thing I don't think it worked on was a ringworm. So definitely, you know, there are times where we do need to go to our doctor and get medical treatment. So uh, please do that. But um, healing elements is going to be there for you in pretty much every case that you need um, some clean and natural options. So that is my number one favorite. It's number uh, one customer favorite as well. It's been the number one customer favorite for the past 20 years, pretty much. <laughs> so um, my second favorite item is our Revival Balm. This here is great for inflammation. It has coffee and turmeric in it. Uh, so it's great for um, muscle inflammation, joint inflammation. I use it on my knees a lot. I also have a very slight tear in my um, rotator cuff and my shoulder. So anytime that that's acting up and I can feel that kind of inflamed, I'll pop this on there and it usually um, within, within like 15 minutes, I am not feeling that pain anymore. So I really like the Revival Balm. The next balm, um, is also kind of muscle and joint related. It's gonna be the recovery balm. This is really great for muscle soreness. So if you have a great workout, or maybe you have, um, you know, did some extra housework that was a little more intensive than what you're used to, uh, this will help tremendously. Again, within 15 minutes, uh, sometimes if I have some back pain from like carrying the kiddos or maybe I slept wrong one night, um, this works really, really well. If you're looking for a natural form of Icy Hot, then I'm going to recommend you use the Recovery Balm as well as the Soothing Balm together. Um, and then it kind of gives you that natural Icy Hot, but not the chemicals that are in the Icy Hot. So that's really nice. Um, the Soothing Balm has peppermint and it also has menthol in it to help with that. And to go back, just in case I didn't mention, um, the Recovery Balm has clove and cinnamon. So that's really good for your, for your um, muscle soreness. Um, but, it, but to go back to your soothing balm here, the, uh, peppermint and menthol is really, really good. Um, I also use it for common colds that we might have any congestion, um, on the chest, on the back, and then on the soles of the feet usually works really, really well. Um, and then that leads me to one of our, uh, final balms. This is, is number five. It's the newest balm that has been added to the collection. We have a lot of gal 
girls um, that have eczema or psoriasis or just extra dry, dry skin, this Restore Balm is going to be perfect for you. Um, if you're washing hands a lot, it it leaves a natural um, kind of protective barrier um, after you wash your hands. You might want to, you know, put this on as well as um, followed by some lotion um, and this will pretty much leave your hands protected most of the day. So this has frankincense and myrrh in it. Um, so again, those were great uh, essential oils that were used way, way, way long ago, right? Um, for those of you um, that might be familiar with your Bible, um, those were very um, highly uh, well-known essential oils that people used for healing. So that's your Restore Balm. And then um, they all come in these fabulous one ounce sticks um, with this uh, screw top. Um, and this is a brand new balm. So it might take a second here. Um, but you can take off the protective cap, rub it on the skin, and um, then you have that protective uh, coating back on. So I, my husband really loves this because um, if we have to treat the boys with something, he doesn't get it on his hands. He just kind of opens it up, um, rubs it on, and then we're good to go. So for those of you that might be sensitive with um, you know, uh, things on your hands, uh, this is a great option because you don't even have to touch whatever it is you're trying to to uh, treat, you can just, you know, rub it on and you're good to go. So it comes in the one ounce form in all five, as well as a uh, six ounce tub. So this is the family size and highly, you know, recommend it. This is gonna be your best value. As you can see, I've used quite a bit, um, but I do use a little spatula here to kind of get out anything that I might need. Um, and I can use it on, you know, just kind of pop it on there. Um, and so it's really easy to use. Uh, right now it happens to be um, in the winter months. So my hands are always, you know, dry, um, but it will help with uh, moisturizing and keeping the hands protected. So the, that is your option. So they all come in the one ounce sticks as well as the six ounce family size ones. And then I thought I would share our seasonal balm that we have every October. It's the pink healing balm. And one reason that I love Lemongrass Spa is they are always giving back. And so in October we have this special balm for Breast Cancer Awareness Month where um, one to two dollars will go to breast cancer research and breast cancer foundations and this is how the restore bomb got started because it does have the frankincense in this uh, pink healing balm and it also has a little bit of peony and rose in there so very um, just uh, clean again clean ingredients essential oil based the calendula helps with the healing as well and so this is just kind of a fun um, balm to help uh, promote the breast cancer awareness and again it's seasonal only available in October but it is one of the favorites so I hope you guys have been uh, well informed and it covers what all of our bombs are and I would love to know which one is going to be used in your family the most. Thanks so much for joining me and I hope you'll have a great day.